the genome of a plant or animal contains a huge amount of information, but it's not all useful. Introducing DART ReSeq, DART's new way of analysing a genome and simplifying the process of finding answers to genetic questions. The genome of bread wheat, for example, is particularly obese. The DNA of one molecule, if stretched right out, would look like a ladder about 10 metres long, but only two billionths of a metre wide. That's about as tall as a four-storey building, but so thin you'd need an electron microscope to see it. What's more, this ladder would have about 17 billion rungs. When a farmer, breeder, researcher or ecologist sends a sample for genetic analysis by DART, the key genetic data they need could be anywhere on that ladder. DART ReSeq is a shortcut to identifying which rungs on the ladder are worth looking at and which aren't. It's a method that saves both time and cost. Most of the information on our 10 metre strand is so-called junk DNA, repetitive and not of much help. The genes are the place in the genome that control the action. DART ReSeq works by introducing enzymes that biochemically remove these highly methylated junk sequences from the libraries prior to sequencing. At the same time, these enzymes enrich the remaining useful segments of the genome, the ones containing genes. This reduces the amount of sequencing required to achieve an almost complete DNA profile of a sample, providing reliable results in a fraction of the time and at a fraction of the cost, without the complexity of having to climb all the way to the fourth floor. <laughs>